the Sangha Supreme Council has issued urgent letters to the temples around the country, barring monks and novices from partaking in any political activities. If they are found in violation of the order, the chief monk of the administrative division can just proceed to take this disciplinary action. And the director of the National Office of Buddhism, Narong Song Arom, said that since there were images of monks and novices at the protest, both the National Office of Buddhism and the Sangha Supreme Council have sent letters to the local administrative bodies two to three times already. Since some monks and novices still attended the protest last Sunday, the Sangha Supreme Council has to issue these four resolutions. The first one is the National Office of Buddhism will notify the chief monk of the administrative division to take action against monks and novices who violate the order not to join any political activities, which this rule has been established since 1995. The abbot, the second one is the abbot of Trimit Vithyara Morayvihan Temple will draw up guidelines and long-term solutions to prevent monks and novices from joining such protests. And a list of monks and novices who violate the order will be sent to their administrative division to consider whether their actions violate the norm discipline or in Bali word is Dhamma Vinaya. The National Office of Buddhism will notify law enforcement to investigate the status of monks and novices who joined the protest to prevent people from masquerading as monks from defaming Buddhism. So whether the monks and novices who violate the rules will have to leave the monkhood or not, it is a decision for the local administrative division to decide. The punishment can range from just a warning to expulsion. So there were seven monks and novices seen at the protest on Sunday. The status of one monk and one novice have been verified. However, there is another five, which is still unclear. So I don't, I don't think we're going to see any more monks joining the protest from now on, I guess. The thing is, what they protest is they said that the Sangha Supreme Council is actually also dictatorial. Right. Mm -hmm. But this is order from the Sangha Supreme Council as well.